Lisa and I'm one of the keepers here at Colchester Zoo. Today I'd like to introduce you to our reindeer. I'd like to start by introducing you all to Ronnie. He's our oldest reindeer that we have here at the zoo and he's eight years old. He's the most dominant of the four. He's a very bossy reindeer who likes to have first choice on all the food. He spots if you've got treats and he's first in line to get hold of those as well. He's also the biggest reindeer we have, weighing in at 130 kilos. Next up, this is Hickory. Hickory is seven years old and the easiest way to identify him is he has white circles around his eyes. He's a very chilled reindeer who likes his own space and he's the smallest out of the four. Ash is also seven years old. He has a much darker face and muzzle. He really enjoys his food and quite often just keeps himself to himself. Lastly, we have Sammy. He's also seven years old. He's a very affectionate reindeer and is often following us about while we're in the paddock working. He enjoys a tickle, especially between those antlers. You may not realise, but the reindeer actually live at the zoo all year round. They're not always on show, but during the festive period, we'll open up the enclosure for everyone to come and have a close look at them. They're quite happy to see the visitors even from a distance and at times they do come up for a close up look. They don't like to be touched on the antlers, but they absolutely love a little tickle on the nose. Reindeer naturally would live in the Northern Hemisphere. As you can imagine, this is very cold indeed. So the reindeer need to keep themselves very warm. The fur on a reindeer's coat covers its entire body from its head to its toes. It's incredibly thick and you might be surprised it's actually hollow. The fur acts as a great insulator to capture all the air surrounding it and helps to keep the animal warm. They can withstand temperatures of minus 40 degrees. During the summer, the reindeer will then molt out this thick coat and have a much cooler one. Now, if you listen carefully, you may just hear the clicking noise as they walk. We're often asked if the reindeer are okay or if they have arthritis. The simple answer is they're absolutely fine and the clicking noise is completely normal. It's a way of communication between the animals. It's made up from the small tendons in their toes slipping over the bones, which creates this noise. In thick snowstorms, they can hear each other and stay together. Now, if we have a close-up look at their feet, you'll see that they have their very own snowshoes. With four toes on each foot, they evenly distribute the weight over each of these feet, acting as a snowshoe. This allows them to walk on ice and snow without slipping. Their toes are incredibly sharp and allow them to dig through the ice to get water, as well as food that they might find along the way on their journey. Well, I hope you've enjoyed listening to the talk about the reindeer today. We really can't wait to open again so you can guys can come and see them yourselves and meet them up close. They're fantastic animals and a firm favourite of mine. But for now, we're in lockdown. Everything's still being looked after absolutely fine here at the zoo. And uh, we look forward to seeing you guys again soon.